Hello, you're welcome. How to solve for x in this nice exponent problem? Yeah, let's take this side to this side and we can write it as x raised to power 4 minus into bracket x minus 4 raised to power 4 now equals to 0. And here, let's factor power of 2 out here and we have x square then also square minus here as well into bracket x minus 4 square then we have also square from here which is equal to 0 and from here this follow the pattern for difference of 2 square that is a square minus b square which we can write as a plus b times a minus b so when we follow this from here, here a is standing as x square and b is standing as x minus 4 square. So we are going to have a plus b that is x square plus into bracket x minus 4 square then multiply by a minus b that's x square then minus into bracket x minus x minus 4 square then equals to 0 then next day we can solve this from here and in this bracket we expand this so here we have x square now plus expansion here give us x square minus 2 2 times x times minus so that's minus 8x then that will be plus 4 square and which is 16 then in this second bracket we have x square then this minus we maintain a bracket because minus we affect the bracket here so we have x square as well then minus 8x then plus 16 then close bracket equals to 0 then in the next step from here we have x square plus x square. This gives us 2x square. Then we have minus 8x. Then we have plus 16. Second bracket as well. This minus open first. We have x square minus x square. Then plus 8x now. Then minus 16 which is equals to 0 then from here we still have it as 2x square minus 8x plus 16 then this bracket becomes x minus x square minus x square has come then we have 8x minus 16 equals to 0 then from here we have these two possible cases and then let's write this first and we have 8x minus 16 equals to 0 here and on this side we have 2x square minus 8x plus 16 equals to 0 so for this side when we solve for x we have 16 come here become plus so that's 8x equals to 16 from here then divide both sides by 8 and we have x to be equal to 2 which is the real solution from here so we have x equals to 2 here then on this side we have a quadratic equation and we can divide through by 2 such that this becomes x square minus 4x now then plus we have 8 equals to 0 now here we can solve this using quadratic formula x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac all over 2a and in this case our a is 1 b is minus 4 and c is 8 so substituting this formula now we have x now equals to minus minus 4 
plus or minus square root of minus 4 square then minus 4 times 1 10 times 8 over 2 times 1 and solving from here now this gives us x equals to 4 plus or minus square root of minus 4 square root of 16 then minus 4 times 8 that's 32 then all over 2 then 16 minus 32 that's minus 16 so we have x now equals to 4 plus or minus square root of minus 16 over 2 and root minus 16 can be written as root 16 times root minus 1 and root 16 is 4 root minus 1 is i so that's 4 i so here we have x now equals to 4 plus or minus 4 i over 2 and here we can separate this as 4 over 2 plus or minus 4 i over 2 which will give us here 2 plus or minus 2 i so here we have two complex solution here and uh, we can now say that the first solution here which is can be written as x1 is equal to 2 and x2 from here we can pick the positive one first that is we have 2 plus 2i now that's x2 and x3 we have 2 minus 2i so here we have these three solutions for this particular problem and then we have come to the end of this class thank you for watching don't forget the steps Subscribe for more exciting videos and turn on the notification bell. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and then thank you. You can also put your comment in the comment section. See you next class and bye for now.